Hey, what's up, guys? Let's make a video. Um, if you get the error while using uh, the X360 key when you first turn it on, for example, so you, I got the X360 key right there. It's installed, and then it'll boot up, and it'll come to a red light when you first get it. I'll show you right here. I'll show you the error message you get, and I'll show you how to fix it. Um, so it'll boot up right there. I don't know if you really see it. Xbox logo. Wait for it. Still booting up. You'll see the X360 key's not doing anything. It's just it's just got a little key on it. And you'll get this message right there. E64 system error. Okay? You have a red light on your Xbox. Okay, now this is how you fix it. So turn that off. So the problem was is, is it's not formatted correctly. If you're using a, a SD card, you didn't. If it did not come with an SD card, you have to do it this way. Um, let me close all this down real quick. So what you want to do is I'll put a, I'll put a link on here as well. Um, but you, it's uh, recovering a corrupt SD card. Um, pretty much, what you have to do is you have to go to this USB imaging tool here, uh, load it up. So I'll show you what it looks like right here. Um, Let's see, start, okay, uh, I have it right here on my desktop. So I have it right here in a new folder. So it's USB imaging tool. If you can see it right there. You right click, run as administrator. Click yes. Your USB thing will pop up right here. Um, you'll, you'll also need to download this file right here, which is the uh, imaging, imaging tool. Uh, then you'll come over here. Um, you'll you'll click on the device, you'll click on restore, and you'll choose this file right here when it pops up and asks you, uh, which is you know it's 120 megabytes. It's the imaging tool. Anyways, once that's done, I'll show you here. I got I got I got this one right here that was imaged right here. So we just hold it right here. So once you insert the new SD card. That was formatted correctly, and you put your dummy.bin in here too. You're probably thinking, you know, your dummy's not working right or something. So there's the new SD card. I just put it in, the formatted one. There's the one that was not formatted. I just add the dummy.bin in the new files. Now I turn it on. You can see it turned on right now. You see the X360 key. There's the Xbox right there. So once you once you format it and add those files again, look, instantly boot it up. Emulation's working. I don't know if you can really see that or not. I'm gonna focus it. Um, but anyways, it's working now. Uh, you can you know eject the disk. You can load USB. Uh, obviously, no more red lights. So that's how you fix the uh, the E error you get if the SD card is not working. Um, like I said, if you have any more questions, I'll put the link right below. So you guys can see where the website and what you guys need to do. Uh, if you have any more questions, post it. I'll answer. I'll help you get your stuff working. All right. Have a good one.